Hello everyone. Before diving into today's topic, we want to take a moment to thank you for your support. Every like, comment, and subscription truly makes a difference and helps this channel grow. If you enjoy our content and don't want to miss the next videos, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell to receive all updates. The history of the Rach negative blood group is an enigma that extends beyond the boundaries of genetics and modern medicine, shedding light on evolutionary mysteries, historical hypotheses, and controversial theories. Although it represents a small portion of the global population, about 15% of humans, the RH negative group has fascinated scientists, researchers, and even conspiracy theorists. Its existence raises questions not only about how it evolved, but also about what significance it may hold for the future of humanity. The unique characteristics of this blood variant, its rarity, and the legends surrounding its origin continue to spark curiosity and speculation. To better understand the mystery of the Rach negative group, it is necessary to examine the genetic basis of its origin. Our blood, as we well know, is not just a mixture of vital fluids, but a living map that tells the story of our evolution. The presence of the RH factor in our blood is the result of a single gene called RHD located on chromosome 1. This gene is responsible for the production of the RH protein, an antigen found on the surface of red blood cells. Those with the RH positive factor have this protein, while those who are RH negative do not. Its discovery dates back to the 1940s when biologist Carl Landsteiner, one of the pioneers in the field of blood genetics, identified the RH system, revealing the link between blood type and the possibility of developing immune reactions during transfusions. However, genetics does not fully explain why the Rach negative blood group exists. While blood groups A, B, and O can be explained through the ABO gene, the RH group does not fit easily into the same evolutionary narrative. Some hypotheses suggest that the RH negative gene may be the result of an isolated genetic mutation that occurred thousands of years ago, but there is no concrete evidence explaining how or why this mutation emerged. One fascinating aspect of this mutation is that, although rare, it has had a lasting impact on certain populations, with a surprisingly high concentration of RH negative individuals in specific areas, such as the Basque country while being scarce in other geographical regions, such as Africa and Asia. Beyond scientific explanations, the Rach negative blood group has become fertile ground for bold and fascinating speculations. Its rarity and irregular geographical distribution have led many to believe that there might be a more mysterious and perhaps even extraordinary explanation behind its existence. One of the most popular, though scientifically unsupported, theories is that the RH negative group could be the result of a genetic crossbreeding between humans and an extraterrestrial civilization. According to proponents of this hypothesis, the RH negative group might derive from an ancient genetic manipulation carried out by entities from other worlds. Some theorists claim that these beings, often described as ancient astronauts, had a direct impact on human evolution, influencing our genes to create a new biological variant. The idea of a crossbreeding between humans and an extraterrestrial civilization traces back to popular theories, including those related to the so-called ancient astronaut theory, which suggests that intelligent beings from other stars visited Earth in ancient times and interacted with early civilizations. According to some, these interactions could have included genetic modifications, an idea that is both fascinating and unsettling. Even popular culture has contributed to reinforcing these ideas, with stories about hybrids between humans and extraterrestrials. Author Zechariah Sitchin, for example, in his series of books on the ancient astronaut theory, speculated about the existence of an alien race called the Anunnaki, who allegedly genetically manipulated early humans. In this context, the hypothesis of the RH negative group as a result of extraterrestrial parentage does not seem so far-fetched, although it lacks any scientific basis. Some researchers have suggested that the uniqueness of the RH negative group could also be explained by genetic manipulation carried out by advanced terrestrial civilizations in antiquity. These civilizations might have had advanced technologies that allowed them to alter human genes to create a race with superior characteristics or adaptability to specific environmental conditions. However, this theory also remains purely speculative. 
Numerous ancient legends seem to foreshadow the idea of beings with unique characteristics interacting with humans. The mythologies of many cultures, such as the Sumerian, Egyptian, and Greek, speak of gods or supernatural beings descending from the sky and interacting with humans. Some believe these stories could be interpreted as evidence of ancient contacts with extraterrestrial races. In Sumerian mythology, for example, the Anunnaki were deities who came from the heavens and were said to have taught humans the arts of writing, agriculture, and construction. Some theorists suggest that hybridization between humans and these divine entities could be the foundation for the creation of the Rache negative blood group. This interpretation of ancient mythologies, which includes the idea of divine or extraterrestrial genetics, is not new and continues to be a significant part of many alternative theories about our evolution. According to some, the existence of individuals with RH negative blood could be a genetic trace left by these ancient astronauts, who manipulated our biology to create a new race, possibly with special abilities such as resistance to diseases or a predisposition to certain intellectual and physical talents. Beyond extraterrestrial and historical theories, some doctors and psychologists suggest that people with RH negative blood may have distinct psychological and physical traits. Some claim that these individuals possess higher intelligence or a particular spiritual energy. Although there is no definitive scientific evidence to support these claims, some suggest that blood groups may influence personality in subtle ways, a concept that has been explored in some cultures, particularly in Japan, where blood type is believed to be related to psychological traits. Despite these psychological claims, it is important to emphasize that there is no concrete evidence suggesting that people with RH negative blood are psychologically or physically superior. Rather, the rarity of the blood group may be the basis for such speculations. While the boldest theories about the relationship between the RH negative blood group and extraterrestrials are fascinating and intriguing, it is essential to understand that for now, they remain purely speculative and unsupported by scientific evidence. Human genetics is complex and fascinating, and although there are still many mysteries to unravel, the most scientific hypotheses continue to support the idea that the RH negative blood group is the result of an isolated evolutionary mutation in our species' distant past. However, the mystery of the RH negative group persists, not only in biological terms but also in cultural ones. As science advances and new discoveries are made in genetics and DNA research, one can only wonder whether we will one day truly uncover the origins of this fascinating characteristic of our blood. Until then, the RH negative group will continue to be a topic of speculation, wonder, and undoubtedly, ongoing fascination for those drawn to the mysterious and unknown possibilities of our existence. Thank you for watching. Remember to support the channel and see you in the next video.